The following portion of Bloom is sponsored by Hospital for Endocrine Surgery. Parathyroid disease is a common and very detrimental disease, yet no one has ever heard of it. Joining me now to raise awareness during Parathyroid Disease Month is Dr. Jim Norman with the Hospital for Endocrine Surgery. It's so good to see you again, doctor. Good seeing you again, Gal. So talk to me about parathyroid glands. What are they and what do they do for our body? Well, it's interesting. Most people never heard of parathyroid glands, but we all have four parathyroid glands. They're pair around the thyroid. So they're two on the left, two on the right, on the back side of the thyroid gland. You can't live without them. That's how important they are. They run the calcium in our blood. And that's important because the calcium runs our electrical system of our nerves. So the analogy I use is like our car has an electrical system and our, uh, and our house has an electrical system where we have, they have electrons that flow through wires. In our body, we have Instead of wires, we have nerves, and instead of using electrons, we flow calcium. So the house has um, a voltage regulator that keeps it about 110 volts, and the car has about a 100. Uh, a car has about a 12 volt, you know, voltage regulator. The parathyroid glands are the voltage regulators for the calcium, so that we have a normal calcium level, so our electrical system of our nerves works well. So if you're car voltage regulator goes bad and the, and the voltage goes too high, the car fries. Our, our parathyroid glands run our calcium levels, keep it in a normal level. If a parathyroid gland becomes a tumor, the calcium goes too high and it fries our electrical system. So what's an indicator that we need to be looking for that something might be wrong? It's actually really simple. It's the blood calcium level. So everybody knows what their cholesterol level is, right? Well, a calcium level is more important than cholesterol. A high calcium is more deadly than high cholesterol. So everybody should know what their cholesterol, they should know what their cholesterol levels, but they really should know what their calcium levels are. And if your calcium level is high, that means you've got a bad voltage regulator, a bad parathyroid gland, which is a parathyroid tumor. How do you treat this doctor? You take out one of the parathyroid glands. So you have four parathyroid glands, um, it's the only thing that we have four of. That's how important it is. God gave us four of these because it's a quadruple redundant system. So when, when it goes bad, usually it's one of them that goes bad. And so you simply take out the one and you still have three normal ones left. So it's a small operation. You need to take it out. Now, I know you, you specialize in this. What would should we be looking for in a surgeon? Well, you, they're in the neck. They're behind the thyroid. There's a lot of vocal cord nerves and other nerves in the neck that's sort of busy in there. So you really need a surgeon who has an expertise in parathyroid surgery. So the hospital for endocrine surgery, we do more than anybody else in the whole world. People come here from all over the world for our expertise. Um, and so you really want a surgeon who does this all the time that, so that complications don't arise, you don't lose your voice, those sorts of things. Yeah, I was gonna say, what happens if you leave this untreated? So parathyroid disease will eventually kill you. If you have a parathyroid tumor for like 20 years, you'll, you'll die of it. So it's really a bad problem. It causes bad osteoporosis. All the calcium comes out of your bones and, and into your blood. So your bone calcium goes low. You get bad osteoporosis and fractures. And the high calcium goes into your blood. And so it causes calcifications of your coronary arteries, calcifications of your kidneys, kidney stones. So it, it affects a lot of different things all over your entire body from this little teeny thing in your neck. Crazy. Doctor, thank you so much for sharing this really important information with our Bloom viewers. Right. Great to see you. Good to see you too. Head to parathyroid.com, a great free online resource on parathyroid gland function, normal calcium levels, parathyroid disease, parathyroid surgery, and more. Bloom will be right back. The preceding portion of Bloom was sponsored by Hospital for Endocrine Surgery.